can you fix my brother Joe? <laughs> That's been an opening question, by the way, in some uh, from from a prospect. And I said, no, I can't fix your brother Joe, but I can uh, if you want to move forward, articulate some of the strengths of Joe and others on the leadership team, and then that cohort of next gens, we can look at what they need to do next. So one example is representative. Imagine a fast growing company, 40% year over year. They've got five mid-level managers, two are family, three are non-family. So they're all next gen leaders. Amid that rapid growth, they know that the current president and the current CFO are going to retire. They'll serve on the okay. board. They're going to they're going to retire, and and they should. And it's bright and it's proper, and everybody's doing things with their eyes wide open. Well, the owner says, "Doug, I don't know how to assess their capacities. Five leaders, two are my boys. Three mm-hmm. are great, mm-hmm. well talented. How do we accelerate their careers?" So, the owners often need directionality and they need good consulting that's based on multiple perspectives. Typically that comes in two forms, quantitative and qualitative. Great. But we knocked out that process in, I don't know, 60 days, provided them the directions they need. And I continue to work with those leaders over time. And the transition is going very smoothly. None of that would have happened as smoothly if the assessment process hadn't been as robust. 